Today is all about Queen Charge Hybrid. We're on our Town Hall 12 to start, and we're hitting up against a Town Hall 13. Granted, there is no CC. So notice on the space that at least a couple of these compartments, there is no Ground Expo or Mortar that could hurt a Flame Flinger. But when I try to do hybrids, I always try to have a plan for the Town Hall, at least with my Queen, if possible. And in this case, I'm going to charge my Queen and try to grab this Town Hall. But since these flanks over here are not covered by a mortar or an expo, I'm going to drop a flame flinger. I'm thinking if I drop a flame flinger over here, it could grab all this value like that. My queen, she can make her way up to the top side. I could wall break and then wall break again and get into the town hall. So she could grab the town hall here. And now what we could do is we need to find a way to funnel. So what I want to try to do is actually send the hybrid like this into the eagle artillery but the problem is i need to funnel this down here well how am i going to do it i'm going to use my king yes i'm going to use a king on the outside to get him to go this way he'll take out a bomb tower maybe drop a wizard like this or something or have the raw champion well actually there's no raw champion town 12 either way we're going to send the hybrid in between the flame flinger and where the king goes into the core of this base and the queen will just continue to charge her way to the top side so that's the plan let's give it a shot here okay so, got to get this flame flinger down nice and early. Got to get the queen down here. All right. So, we only got two wall breaks. So, I'm going to drop a wall break once this queen takes the damage. There we go. All right. Now, we can drop the rest of the healers. I'm going to drop a hog out in front of here. I'm going to wall break you now. Okay. Well, okay, drop a balloon here. Okay, the reason why I dropped the hog to the left side is to test for a test on the outside. Uh, I'm gonna drop a wizard here, a wizard here. Drop some more balloons like this. To really try to test the area for traps. Pop the ability because I almost lost my queen. Don't want to lose her there. Okay, let's get the king down here. Queen is securing the town hall. Drop a flame flinger here. I don't want to lose the queen here, so let's see if I can. I do have poison spell, so we'll slow down to the defensive king. Why not? Drop a uh, wizard hog up there with a wizard. King ability goes off. Here goes the miners, the warden, hogs right through here. Don't want to lose my queen. All right. Let's see. Where are my hogs? Now let's go and heal them up here. Let's go and freeze up this air expo area. Come on, miners. Move your way on through. Pop the ability. Okay. They're so weak. Let's drop a heal here. Let's drop some archers up and around like this. We're gonna go and open up the Valkyries to come out of here. Freeze up this expo so that the Warden maybe can stay alive. No, he's dead. Okay. So this Queen is going for air skellies. But we have a single target Inferno. Come on. Come on, Valks. The Queen is gonna go for the wall eventually. But it is a single target Inferno here. All right, let's drop a Headhunter. I don't even know. Valks are going for the wall. That's helping. We got one headhunter. Come on, queen. All oh, these Valks, they're struggling. They're struggling. Oh, boy. I can try to drop a headhunter up here. Queen could go for the single target Inferno. And I'm going to die fail this. Dang it. I mean, I did have a poison spell. I do have these archers around. The queen will continue her way. Oh, she does loop her way up and around that way. Okay. 95, 96. But hey, you know... The problem is down here, you don't have that much strength with the hybrid is if they split off in different ways, but it is only a Town Hall 12 there hitting up. And let's go with another Town Hall 12 attack against the Town Hall 13, but the difference is on my Warden, I'm putting a Life Gem, while the last time it was a Rage Gem. So well, what's the plan here? I'm noticing on this base that this whole side of the base, there is nothing that can take out a Flame Flinger. No Mortar and no Expos over here. 
So I'm thinking if I drop a flame flinger up here, I could help take out all of this. Then I could get like maybe a king or something, maybe just some balloons, take this out, try to charge my queen into the single target inferno. How many freezes do I have? I have a couple. So I could get the queen trying to charge her into here. I'd probably then drop my king to go into here to try to take out the enemy queen with the ability while the flame flinger goes and takes out all this. And it'll be a little bit of an awkward hybrid where then the hybrid will kind of come through the bottom side down here uh, while the queen will walk her way into the town hall around here. So that's kind of the plan. Well, let's see what happens with a 10 12 versus a 13. What I'm going to do is going to drop a... I know there's no Teslas here because of these little obstacles or things a statue so definitely you don't want to have those on your bases especially inside because people will know that there can't be a tesla there so that is putting you at a disadvantage put a flame flinger here but sometimes i'll just drop a hog here to really kind of test and nothing there all right we're good so flame flinger will take its time and we have a couple balloons so we could use the queen over here to tank uh the air expo or well, we'll just wall break this. Okay, we're gonna have to drop the healers here. Okay, drop a wizard. Let's see. Uh, let's drop the king here. Drop some balloons. Rage. Freeze. Drop a hog. Alright, King will get lured to the enemy queen here. King, you're supposed to go into the base. Go into the base, King. Alright. Well, we didn't take out the enemy queen. Okay, that's fine. Drop a balloon here. Seeking air mine. Eagle goes down. And the rest of the hogs. Miners. The warden. All right, we got an ice. Okay, we're going to rage up the queen. Poison you. All right, let's see. Go and heal this. Queen's got to go get the town hall. Drop a headhunter into here. Freeze this. Drop a heal. Like so. Flame flinger's getting some nice value. We're trying to keep this these things alive here. We got a wall break. Maybe I can wall break this over here. Drop an archer to distract for that right there. Oh, make you invisible. And then the defensive king is stolen up our miners. Come on, miners, get that scatter shot. Oh, Valks are going over there. They got that to that one scatter. Come on, let's see. Do we have enough? Do we have enough here? The Valkyries are going. Scatter goes down. We still have the Queen. Pop the ability to help damage these. Oh, the Warden dies. The Valkyries are running. Drop an Archer here. 27 seconds. Come on, Queen. These are defenses are low because of the giant arrow. Did we get it? Do we hit up the 12 versus 13? 17 seconds. Come on. I think some of these are low health. Like, it should be a one-shot cannon. Yep. Oh, two shots. 12. And I think we got it here. 12 versus 13. That flame flinger got so much value because there was nothing to take it out. Next, we have Town Hall 13 versus a 13. But this base, I mean, this is a very weird base here. But I'm noticing the clan castles in the core. Whenever you're trying to do a hybrid, you want to try to deal with the clan castle early. But how do you deal with the clan castle early if it's all the way in the middle? Well, you could do two things. One, you could try to charge the queen somewhere into the base and try to have the queen take it out, which might take a long time. But the second way, which is faster to lure the clan castle out, is using a blimp to fly somewhere in this circle. So what I'm thinking is I want to not only pull the clan castle with a blimp, but also create a path so my queen can follow where kind of the blimp kind of came from and then make her way to the town hall. And the only area really is down here plus there's the enemy heroes down here which i could take out and a lot of expo so there should be a lot of value so if i drop a blimp with a straight line like this 
with the thought process of the blimp landing right about here, it can then lure out this clan castle, which means I'll have to freeze up the sweeper because it will have to it will push my blimp back. So I'll have to freeze it up as the blimp will go here, land, pull the clan castle out. But not only that, it's going to take out these defenses. I mean, the queen can reach them anyways, uh, but we're going to use like a maybe uh, some funneling stuff over here. So our queen can make her way through here and we can try to wall break down here and get the queen to go into this town hall. So we'll just have to funnel this or we'll have to maybe use an invis spell to get the queen to go into the town hall. And now the thought process is this will be down from the blimp. The queen will take this out, all of this. So that means we need to now set the funnel for the hybrid through here and the king has got to come up here. So if I wall break the king up here and I try to get the king through like this, then the hybrid should be able to make its way through the core like that. So that's the thought and let's give it a shot. Okay. So I got to go with, uh, well, I don't have an invis, so hopefully I can still get the queen to go in there. So let's see. So let's go with a balloon. So a balloon, I got to get the angle right. Balloon, blimp, freeze the sweeper. Okay, I'm gonna try not. Okay, boom, it lands. Okay, got the wizard here. I could drop the queen like this. Perfect, look at all that value we take down. Drop a balloon and the healers. Okay, wow, there's a lot of, uh, a lot of traps over here. Headhunter here. All right, so we're gonna clear this. We'll just take out these ice golems, why not? All right. Drop a poison here to deal with this. We wall break that. More ground skeletons. Jeez, hello. Okay. Drop a rage. Drop another balloon. Oh, there's an ice golem come over here. Drop a wizard. All right, so I want to get the wall break here. The queen's going to charge through here. So that means I'm going to drop the king on this left. Oh, he's going to go up. Okay. Well, with that being said, we're just going to drop the warden here. Another rage. Freeze that. Drop a baby dragon. Yeah, because once I realize that my king is going up, I'm just going to send the hybrid through. Wall break. Royal champ. Pop king ability. Drop a heal for these hogs. Okay. Drop a rage into the core. Pop warden. Probably could have popped warden a little bit uh, later. Let's see here. Tunnel goes down. Where's my miners? Okay, there's the giant bomb in the core. Go and heal them up. And it should be fine. Queen, do you have a giant arrow queen? I think you do. I've been rocking the giant arrow a lot. Let's just drop a wizard up here. And yeah, we should be fine. You can see the value that the queen got walking around. The big thing was I pulled out that clan castle early. You don't want to leave that clan castle for the end or in the middle of the attack because then you just get slowed down with your main army. And the queen is usually the best case scenario to deal with the CC. That's why I went with that blimp. And now Town Hall 14 here, 14 versus 14 with this Town Hall all the way in the middle. And take note where the mortars and expos are. We have an expo here, here, here. The symmetrical base would mean that the next expo should be here, but it's not. It's all the way over here, which means I could take advantage of the, him moving this expo by placing a flame flinger here, taking out all of this. Right, because I do, well, I don't have a Yeti. I mean, I could take a Yeti to try to distract this mortar, but I, I think it should be fine. After it takes all this value down, it will get some more value, then the Valks will come out of the Flame Flinger. So this whole area will be taken out with the Flame Flinger. I will, so this will go down from Flame Flinger. I will charge the Queen from this side, move her way through here, so she'll go down this way, completely gutting this side. I could drop the King possibly over here as well to help the Queen. Maybe try to wall break, maybe get a second get a layer here. But the big thing is with my queen, as she's charging here, the whole reason is to then grab the clan castle with my queen. And then since the flame flinger is going to clear this side, I'm going to send the hybrid right in between to go into the core 
like so with the warden ability through the middle to get all that value so both sides of this base will be taken care of and the hybrid will go right into the middle with a warden ability to protect it that's the plan let's see if it works all right so flame flinger to start I'll drop a archer to test here no tesla okay now queen here wizard like this balloon healers okay flame flinger will take its sweet time drop a wizard here as well all right so let's see this queen will charge her with her here so i'll drop a rage balloon balloon into here okay continuing your way through poison that maybe wall break king over here okay let's see Char rage this queen up again Make that invisible so the queen can go into the scatter shot. Perfect. There we go. Drop some balloons here. Maybe a baby dragon. And all right. We'll drop another wall break. Hybrid. Warden. Right through here. Raise this queen up again. Freeze you. Send the RC in. Freeze you. Okay. Rage up this core. And Warden Ability will protect everything. Heal on that backside. Drop another wall break, I guess. Drop some wizards. And yeah, relatively easily. Because the both sides flanks were taken out, the hybrid could go right out in. Invis spell just helps kind of reroute just in case if you want for the queen. And yeah, base relatively very simple. Do I have the queen? I don't have. Did I not have the queen arrow on this one? Let's see. Can I press this to see? Where's my queen? And oh, I did. I just never got triggered. We've got our town hall 15 here. So let's take a look at number 29 in this match. And we see it's clan castle in the core. And I'm going to charge the town hall. We do have a couple invis, so I'm going to have to go in with a freeze. But I want my queen to lure out the clan castle. I notice that up in this area, there is no mortars. I mean, even in these corners, there's no mortars other than an air expo here. So our flame flinger can probably be deployed up here and be safe and grab all that value. And then our queen can be deployed to the bottom side, try to wall break her in here, funnel a little bit to get the queen into the monolith take the town hall down pull the cc we'll have to freeze the invisibility and we can drop the king on one of these sides and then the hybrid can pretty much go right on in between the base of wherever the queen goes so that's the plane here let's give it a shot okay so plane flinger uh drop an archer out in front plane flinger now all right so let's drop the queen since it's symmetrical it doesn't matter which way the queen goes so i'm just gonna let the queen kind of decide on her own You're going that way, queen. Gonna have to freeze you. Okay, we have one more freeze to deal with. The invisibility spells. Let's see. So, let's drop another, like, couple of you. That's rage. We're gonna have to freeze. Oh, that was, freeze was too early. Couldn't poison okay pop the ability here okay let's drop the king wall break you rage you up and here goes the hybrid all right and we go queen is dying and queen stand trying to stay alive All right, pop the ability, pop king ability. Cross we go into the core with the hybrid. Try to keep that queen alive. We can. And... Oh, that warden ability didn't hit the queen, but that's okay. Keep going up. 
Hogs. Drop some wizards. Drop a wizard here. And we are able to keep that queen alive. And it should work out here. That uh, freeze was a little too early on the invisibility spells uh, before near that town hall. So that was a little sketch. But I want... Do I even have a... Do I have a haste? Let's see. Pop the ability. Okay, no, I don't have... I don't have the haste file here. But it is a three-star with the hybrid queen grabbing some fantastic value of the town hall plus luring out that clan castle. Now, this one is the lowest one on the war map. And I guess this is what I'm left with here since I'm one of the bottom ones. It's all the rest of the ones are town hall 16s. So how do we want to do this one? This is going to be a little bit interesting because the clan castle is over here and I want to deal with it. So either I can use my blimp to help lure this out or I can try to charge my queen in this area. I don't want to do that. I'm going to charge my queen in this area because you can see the value my queen can reach over these walls is quite a bit. So if I do a flame flinger up here to grab this multi-target inferno bomb tower and all this stuff, my queen can go and charge through here and the hybrid can kind of go in between the queen and the flame flinger. Well, now what about the town hall? Well, I could, because it's very easy to funnel here. It looks like there's no other buildings. So there might be Teslas here, but I think it should be fine. I could just drop my king here and he'll hopefully go into this area and grab the town hall with ability. So the hybrid can just move its way right on through the base like so that's the plan let's give it a shot all right what abilities i got the rage gem and we're good okay here we go so we are going to flame flinger yeah drop the hogs to test for some teslas there aren't any drop the queen here drop some archers no teslas over there okay all right queen where are you gonna go Queen is making her way down this way. Okay. Ah, oh, looks like there's Teslas in here. The baby dragon. There's the healers. Seeking air mine. Safe so far. Pulling out some archers. I'm gonna have to freeze up this because that's quite a bit of damage on my queen. I dropped the hog because I wanted to try to lure out the ice golems a little earlier. Now the rage is through here. Now the king will go like that. Since the eagle is gone, I don't have to worry about like triggering it early. Since I took it down right away. Wall breaking here. All right, balloons going through. Oh, wait, that's not... Okay, my king's going for the wall. I was like, wait, I thought it was an open wall. Okay, never mind. Either way, king's going in is fine. Drop some wizards. Some miners. King ability. Take out the town hall. More of you, warden. Hogs in between. And royal champ. All right. So we'll just freeze up the single... As we continue our way through, a headhunter so we can pop Warden ability to protect. And right about now, drop the heal. See that king taking out so much value there? Just drop a rage here. And technically, you have a lot of rage spells. You can use your rage spells all for the queen if you want. You don't, um, but if you don't have to, then that's when you could start using your rage spells somewhere else. Uh, it's just a multi here. And just drop a wizard like so. And there we go. Relatively easy. Oh, those Valks coming out of the Flame Flinger for a three-star here. Pop Queen ability. I love the arrow. You know, it's it's so much fun for cleanup. You know, yes, you could use it at the beginning, but whatever it comes down to it for cleanup in an attack, to try to line up a shot, it's always really nice. Town Hall 16. Uh, let's take a look at number 12. And this one... I've got a recall spell paired up with my hybrid. Okay, so I have 15 miners, 13 hog riders, and it's going to be that queen charge here. So my plan is to get the queen to help secure the town hall. So I want to get the queen from over here and have her go this way into the town hall, right? I want to try to get that and then pull the queen back. But I'm noticing that there is a mortar on the edge over here. So if I could take this mortar out, Drop a flame flinger down here. I could help grab this and then I can continue the flame flinger this way. 
my queen can go this way recall the queen after the town hall goes down place her back over here and then she can continue her way through here and then i can i can get like the king to go maybe like here wall break and he can completely clear this compartment over here and i know as i'm not using the king to funnel for the hybrid but the flame flinger and the queen funnel themselves and then allows my hybrid to kind of go in between uh the value that i get and then the queen will just continue her way through so i do have one wall break or two wall breaks so one will be the king and maybe the other one for the queen somewhere so all right let's give it a shot all right with the queen charge recall hybrid so we got to make sure we get that down queen here Flame, flame playing early. So, let's get to drop a wizard, balloon. We gotta go. We could go five. So, four is kind of on the safer side. Okay. Alright. Drop a balloon. We are pushing our way in. Queen, go. I, yep, still walks in. Rage. Okay. Let's see. We won't pull out a CC anytime soon here. I think I'm fine to continue this queen to charge in a little bit. Get the poison spell. Can we get the expo? There we go. Ooh, got the last healer just in time. Wall break you. Okay, I'm gonna drop a Yeti here. Yeti to tank that. All right, let's get the king there. Yeti will tank that. Warden. More miners. Balloons. I'm gonna freeze you up. All right, so we're going to rage right on through here. Heal you up. Queen's ability goes off here. Oh boy. We got a lot of hogs moving through. We got a lot of hogs. We're gonna rage. Oh, there's air skellies here. Okay. RC still moving. Queen's still up. What do I even... Okay, I'll poison the defensive king at this point. Since we got through that, Belks will come out of the flame flinger. They'll have to clear that. And the RC even has her haste vial. And this will be good. It's going to be a three-star. It wasn't the prettiest deployment of the hybrid and everything. Look at all those giant bombs that were right through there. As it is a three-star here. Tunnel 16. And there we go. I'll take it. And in this war, uh, how are we doing? We have eight triples. Oh, that tied the war up here. Because we have a one-star. Oh, my. Well, GG.